Here's how you process vocals in Apple Studio. Cleaning up after a recording is essential. You need to scrape the artifacts that shouldn't be there in the first place, like static noise, plosives, crackles, and clicks. Proper timing and tuning are also important, so you must make minor adjustments if necessary. If needed, you can also tweak the vibrato, volume, and pitch ramp. This is the stage where you cut out or reduce the frequencies that cause muddiness and distortion to your vocal. This stage aims to even out the quieter and louder parts to make the vocal sound as consistent as possible. This stage aims to intensify the frequencies that help the vocal shine brighter along with the other instruments. It is common for the sibilants to sound more aggressive after the additive EQ, which is unpleasant to the ear. Therefore, reducing them is a must. Now the last stage is to put some reverb to add depth and help your vocal bend into the mix. It is better to do it with a return channel to have more control over its outcome.